So it's a quick video on Transformers, uh, end of February, um, it's Tuesday, but it can still be a physics fun. And uh, what we've got is a transformer core. So on here, we've got laminated steel in a donut shape, effectively, or toroid, it's square though. We've got a coil here, okay? And normally this coil here, which is quite thick copper, would give an output, a potential difference across here. But instead I put in a nail, and on this transformer coil, we've got 800 turns. Now off screen, I'll see if I can pull it in just to uh, give you a little look, is this huge thing called a Variac, and it's got a little wheel on it. What this does is this is going to increase the potential difference to uh, from 0 to 260, and I'm going to do it on purpose um, to start off small and go big. Okay, so let's see what happens. So we should know what transformers do. If you don't, you can look at a belt square, but in reality, we're taking PD here, which is high, 230 volts, and the PD is going to then be reduced here, and the current's going to go up, and if we don't lose too much power, we should get about 2,000 amps of current flowing through that nail. Let's have a look. Here we go. So, current going up. It's going up. Not a lot's happening. Still not a lot happening. Let's see. We're going right up now. So, quite a high PD is going in. Oh, look what's happening to the nail. And it's glowing. And it's going bright red hot. Very, very hot. And we might be able to melt it. Maybe, maybe. Let's see, 2,000 amps of current. I mean, that's some serious current flow. And it's starting to melt and the sparks are coming off. Still going. I'm getting sparks coming off it now. Gonna back up a little bit. Ooh, lovely. And the sparks are coming off. And it's melting. And it's melting. And... 2,000 amps to melt a nail. And there it goes. I think it's now slightly arcing across so we're going to go down right down and there you've got a nail effectively that we melted all of that current now then what we're going to do we're going to switch off the electricity because it's highly dangerous and we'll just go in a little bit and there you can see that nail has definitely 